when we found out we were pregnant, it was like, what are we going to do? Well, my boyfriend at the time was really grounded in the church. It was really good for me because at the time, I was in a like a very vicious cycle of partying, drinking. So he was like a super good influence on me and God was working through him to send me a message to say, hey, Jafina, you need to slow down or you need to cut it out. Um, so we weren't together anymore and it was like terrifying, obviously, and even maybe like an ego thing, like embarrassing to say like, I'm gonna bring this child into the world and raise um, the child like on my own with or without a partner. Like you wanna be married, you wanna have your own house, you wanna have a career, you wanna have like stable money coming in. And those are all things that I didn't have and neither did my partner. So that's why I think my mind kind of stirred towards abortion at a certain time. And one day I had picked up the phone and called an abortion clinic and like, I kid you not, the phone disconnected. When I was at the pregnancy care center with Paulette, she shared with me her testimony and she gave me like a lot of emotional support, both, both of us, um, that we could just do it and we prayed together. She prayed with us and just reminded us that God has our best interests and that like the babies are blessings from God. So, you know, like if I needed anything, that the pregnancy care center would be there to support me. Like when the baby was here, if I needed wipes or diapers, like they would have my back. And just like leaving the pregnancy care center, it was just like a sign to me, like from God, that God placed me here because this is part of my journey. To think that I was gonna do it on my own was like almost silly of me because if I believe in God and I trust Him, I know that I was never really alone. And it was just like, you know what, God, thank you so much for bringing me here. We have so much more to go and I'm never leaving you. I, I know you're never leaving me and I'm never forgetting about you. Zechariah actually means God has remembered, um, which is like super important. That's what like the name just like stuck with us right away because throughout pregnancy, God never forgot us. Thankfully, God came back and pulled me through it and brought me back. And now my son is here and he's beautiful and life is great.